Good afternoon, welcome back to Tiger Winkles. I thought I'd check in with you guys. Sorry it's been a little while, uh, but we're so busy at the moment with casualties um, during this COVID pandemic. We're certainly living up to our, our tagline of the world's busiest wildlife hospital. And I had a quick look at the figures and despite everything that's going on in the world, we're actually 20% busier than we would be normally at this time of year at the moment. So thank you to everyone for continuing to look after our British wild animals and bring them to us for looking after. And we're absolutely crazy busy here at the moment, but that's okay, that's what we're here for and that's what we love to do. Um, interestingly as well, we're looking at trying to get our visitor centre back open again. Uh, that's a work in progress and we're going to try and open it in the next few weeks, hopefully, with perhaps limited service, limited animals. But we want to be able to get our visitor centre back open so we can get you guys coming in and enjoying our facilities, um, and enjoying seeing the, the wild animals that we have for you to look at and to learn about. So on that, on that note, uh, I thought I'd share with you a case that we've been dealing with recently. So here we've got a grey like goose. You can see him in the background having a, a hydrotherapy session or having a little swim and uh, with Francesca who's uh, carefully doing some hydrotherapy with him. What happened with him was he had a broken leg, so a broken tibia tarsus, and it was broken in the middle. And a few days ago, uh, maybe about five days ago, we did a fracture repair where we put some pins in, a uh, long pin down the middle and some pins in the side and with a big frame on the outside uh, to repair his leg. So hopefully he can get some leg function back. One of the really important parts of his rehabilitation is some hydrotherapy. So we're only a few days post-op, so he's not using the leg very much at the moment, but he is starting to use, use it a little bit. And I wanted to share with you his hydrotherapy session. So I'm gonna flip you guys around. And we're gonna, I'm gonna have a closer look at his hydrotherapy session. So we just gently move him in the water and get him to start using that leg a little bit. You can see the fixators wrapped in this pink dressing on his leg, so that's all the metal work. And for those of you who uh, watch a bit longer, you'll see that a little bit later in this video. So we just move him up and down to try and get him to place that limb. And then we do some gentle movement back and forward as well. And just to start getting him bringing that foot forward. It was quite funny, I checked on him a half an hour ago and he was fine, he was uh, nestled in his straw. And uh, the person that was doing the, the feeding said as soon as I left, he got up and walked across the pen. So he is using this leg. It's just pretty sore, it's still pretty swollen. You get a lot of bruising from surgery. So you can see he's uh, quite enjoying his, his hydrotherapy session, have a little massage of his joints there and just to try and get the blood flow and get him healing. So I'll flip you guys back. So there you go, I hope that's interesting and fun. What we're gonna do now, for those of you that are really interested in the surgery, uh, we're gonna to cut to a time lapse of the surgery. It's a little bit gory in places, but it's quite fast and goes quite through. So um, it's really interesting for those of you that want to see the things we do. It's an advanced technique called a hybrid fixator, and hopefully you'll enjoy. Thank you very much.